KSBW Weather with meteorologist Ferdinand Holum. Hi, everybody. Welcome back and a good Sunday morning to you. As we look around the state this morning, temperatures are on the cool side in many locations, especially as you look up towards Lake Tahoe. Lake Tahoe right now, 36 degrees. This morning, they bottomed out at 31, getting below freezing. So if you are heading to the high country, we've got to watch that. Temperatures are dropping quite chilly in the overnight hours. Dress appropriately. Santa Barbara, Southern California coast right now, 60s and 70s. Even the Central Valley, cool in the 60s as well. Right now, those temperatures in the Central Valley will warm up into the 90s later on today. Lake Tahoe will Warm up comfortably to 73 degrees in Southern California. Not too bad. 70s and 80s. A little heat in Palm Springs. 102 degrees. Got a trough of low pressure moving through the Pacific Northwest, so we've got cooler temperatures there. Mainly 60s and 70s in through the Pacific Northwest. Bismarck, North Dakota, 76 degrees. And then you can see where we've got the the bright purple there. We've got a ridge of high pressure, so we've got temperatures on the hot side there with 98 in uh, Dallas, and then out towards New York, 83, Atlanta, 86. A little uh, tropical update there. In the Pacific, Tropical Storm Jimena. Last weekend, when we were talking about her, she was a Category Four hurricane. Now she's just a tropical storm. But there's Hawaii right there. Watch the forecast cone, just to the north of Hawaii. So not going to really be a big factor as far as rain goes. Could get some outer bands of the rain. But again, big surf, and they've been dealing with a lot of big surf, uh, especially over the last several weeks there with all those hurricanes moving to the north of Hawaii. Out west here, we've got clear skies across our area. We've got a little finger of clouds moving through. A little weak disturbance is going to bring some mid and high level clouds to our area. That's going to create some filtered sunshine. We don't have the marine layer in place, mainly because we've got high pressure building and we've got those offshore winds. You see the arrows pointing to the ocean. That's an offshore wind that's going to actually warm things up as we go through the next couple days. But then as we go through the overnight hour, or actually through the afternoon hours, we'll get a little bit of a sea breeze, things to cool things down a little bit. Uh, so that's about Sunday at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and then we'll take it another 12 hours, where by the morning hours again, tomorrow morning, the winds shift back to that offshore. So no marine layer for tomorrow as well. And that'll be the story for the next uh, several days there. As far as your temperatures go this afternoon, San Francisco 77 degrees under filtered sunshine. Redwood City 87 and Fremont 85, Mountain View 85 as well. And then in the Santa Clara Valley, 92 in Gilroy. That's one of our warmer spots, Hollister, getting in on some of those 90s as well. And then we make our way into the Salinas Valley, 87 in King City, Soledad 84, right here in Salinas, 79. And we'll make our way onto the peninsula with temperatures mainly in the mid 70s across the board there, with the exception of Big Sur and Carmel Valley in the low to mid 80s. And then our last up up in the Santa Cruz Mountains. Getting in on some of the heat there with the low 90s for Boulder Creek, Ben Lomond, Santa Cruz, about inland, about a couple miles, 86 degrees. You get right on the beach. We'll talk about temperatures right around 80 degrees. And here's your seven day forecast. So you can see the warming trend 92, 95, 98. And then we got triple digits as we head towards the latter half of the work week. And then for the coast side numbers, we even get in on some of that action too, where we've got temperatures actually getting into the 90s by the time we get into Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So uh, the Get a little bit of a warm up there, and I don't have any marine layer cloud. That's very rare for me to have on a seven day forecast, not one marine layer cloud or anything. There's a slight chance they may reform again uh, towards the end of the work week, just along the immediate coast wow. to cool things down. But uh, we'll have that inland heat for sure going through next weekend. So, blue skies and sunshine. Blue skies and sunshine. Nice. Sounds like a song. <laughs> I'm not right. going to sing it, though. <laughs> Thanks for <laughs> Better that way.